In this video, we'll show you how to configure an ePlex gateway in the Aurora software. The unit can be set up as a gateway or a router. In this video, we'll set it up as a gateway. To begin, start the Aurora software as an administrator and log in with your username and password. This is only required when configuring the unit as a gateway. In the Aurora software, go to Settings, Application Management, and select Application Utilities from the menu. Select the ePlex and Gateway Settings tab and then the Add button. Fill in the gateway parameters and options. Name the gateway and select All for the gateway to automatically configure the channel. The server IP address and the server name will be automatically populated when configuring gateway units from the server. For the connection type, select between USB or network. For this video, we'll use USB, but let's look at the network option too. By selecting network, you have the option to select a dynamic or static IP address configuration. Uncheck the DHCP option to enter static IP address information. IP address information will be provided by the network administrator. Click the Save button to save your settings. At this time, the Configure button becomes enabled. To configure the unit, first we must factory default the unit. To do this, press and hold the green reset button on the unit while plugging in the mini USB end of the cable into the unit. Release the green button once the connection is made and the green and red LEDs begin flashing. While the unit is completing the factory default procedure, the green and red LEDs will flash in unison. The red LED will stop flashing and the green LED will continue to flash once this is complete. You have successfully set the unit back to factory default and the unit is now ready to be configured as a gateway. Once only the green LED is flashing, select the Configure button to begin the gateway configuration. If successful, an acknowledgement window will pop up. If you need to program another gateway, click No. If you're finished configuring units as gateways, click Yes. After successfully configuring your gateway, check the status by clicking on the System Status button and selecting Status. In the Status screen, select the Gateway Status button on the left-hand side and double-click to open a new status window. In the Status column, you can verify the newly configured gateway is online. This concludes how to configure an ePlex gateway into the Aurora software. For customer service, contact Dorma Kaba.